Circle B Bar Reserve is visited by many people each year. The land is spacious, with 1,267 acres to explore. All sorts of wildlife are found here, which makes it a perfect location for wildlife photographers. Today, alligators will be my topic for discussion. They are an amazing animal that should be respected. In this video, I will not only talk about the life of alligators of Circle B, but I will also discuss safety. Hundreds of alligators live here and are free to roam the land. They mainly eat fish and turtles but will catch larger prey when given a chance. This is why pets are not allowed anywhere on the property. This can be dangerous for your pets and the pet owners as well. If an alligator is determined to capture someone's pet, it will easily turn on anyone who tries to protect it, including the pet's owner. Remember that it is against the law to feed or harass alligators in Florida. An alligator that is fed by somebody today can be the same alligator responsible for killing someone tomorrow or even years from now. If you see an alligator crossing over the trails, keep your distance and enjoy the experience. Do not get too close for a better look or picture. Alligators are known to be very fast and can turn in any direction quickly. Mating season begins in May, and alligators will be more active. They can also be more aggressive so keeping a safe distance is key. Both male and female alligators will call each other by way of bellowing. The rumbling sound of their bellowing can be heard miles away. This usually sounds the alarm for others to respond. If both alligators find interest in each other, they will mate for days or even weeks. It is not unusual for a male to mate with multiple females during the season. In late May or early June, the females will make a nest for their eggs. At Circle B Bar, two trails are usually closed from June to September. Female alligators can be very aggressive at this time when guarding their nest. For the safety of the alligators and humans, the trails must remain closed until it is safe to reopen them. If successful, an alligator's nest will come to life. Baby alligators will emerge and gather near their mothers for safety. Not all will survive during the first year, but most will. Even then, baby alligators can fall victim to other predators, such as the great blue heron. And there is little mother can do about it. But life will go on for these cold-blooded reptiles and each year will repeat the same. If you ever visit Circle B Bar Reserve, look for the alligators that live there, but from a safe distance. If you like this video, hit the like button and subscribe. Thanks for watching.